friends, it's me McCall and welcome back to the YouTube video and today's video I'm gonna show you how I do my makeup Mm. Listen up. I went to a really cool event the other day. When I posted the photos from it, one person, and only one, said, I want to get ready with me for this look. I said, say no more, because mm, I was literally so excited to see that. I really was. Look how cute this mirror is. Let's get right into it. Huh? This is my everyday makeup routine. Ah. First, we're gonna go in with the Milk Makeup Sunshine Skin Tan. I love this because it has SPF and it's super light. It's really hard to get it out. That's all I have to say. Oh my god, okay. Ooh. I'm breaking a sweat over here. Okay, I put this all over. It's like my foundation. I started using it because it's super thin and it's super natural looking, but it evens out my skin tone because I have a ton of redness. Okay, ton of it. I just blend this in with the beauty blender. I think it looks the best, looks the most natural. I already got it wet because I'm a beauty guru. Uh, beauty guru all the way. I am not the most skilled makeup artist. I'm not even a makeup artist, but I love doing my makeup. Like genuinely, I think it's so much fun. I love makeup, makeup loves me, you know? I started doing my own makeup for my events and I just do my everyday makeup because that's where my skill set starts and ends. But it works for me, so purr, purr. This literally does wonders for my skin. Step number two. Then I go in with the Estee Lauder Double Wear Concealer. I put this anywhere I get super red. If I move my face a certain way, it gets bright red. I don't know what's going on, but I put it under my nose. I get so red right there, and I get really red on the corners of my mouth throughout the day. It just gets really red. I don't know. I also put this on any scarring or active blemishes because we say get the fuck out thank you so then i look like this i'm gonna blend this in with a brush i think it's real techniques could be wrong could be wrong but i think i'm right i think that this is more precise than a beauty blender and that's what we're looking for here you just want to keep it right in the areas where i applied it if you have been subscribed to my youtube channel for a while and okay you may know that i used to struggle really bad with acne I've been able to clear it up pretty well, pretty well in recent years or really just the last year. I definitely still get my fair share of breakouts, but they're just not cystic anymore, which is very, very appreciated. Genuinely, this is the perfect makeup look to look like you're not wearing any makeup. So many people ask me, they're like, do you even wear makeup? I'm like, girl, yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, I do. I'm sorry, should I get close? I'm sorry. I should get closer because this is a makeup routine. We've used a skin tint and a concealer so far. We're killing it. We're literally killing the game. But the last concealer I use is the Glossier Stretch Concealer. I have some acne scars. So wherever I have really intense acne scars that don't want to cover up. Nay, <laughs> uh, see. Okay, so I take it on my finger. I will dab, 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 and it disappears. <laughs> Honestly, it is magic. This Glossier Concealer has done wonders for my skin. It really just covers up anything, anything. It will cover up anything. Okay, pretty. I have pretty oily skin, and so I feel like my concealers and skin tints need to soak into my skin before I put other stuff on it. We are gonna do eyebrows to give my skin a second to just suck it all in. And I broke this. Um, I take this Anastasia brow pen, but I just use the spoolie, and I brush them up. Okay. I should probably throw this away now, but I'm not going to. I'm gonna sneeze. No, I'm not. Then I go in with the Glossier Boy Brow Brow Gel, and I just have the clear one. And yeah, I love this brow gel. It's literally my second bottle, but it just runs out really quick. And so I don't know if I'll be getting a third bottle. I'm gonna put some Aquaphor on my lips because my skin is still <laughs> sucking in all the concealer. Eh? But the bing bada boom, Bob's your uncle, you know? You gotta keep our lips hydrated, ladies and gentlemen. I don't care who you are, you gotta keep your lips hydrated. Now that my skin has sucked in all the product, let's move on. One of my favorite products is the Charlotte Tilbury Contour Wand. I saw it on TikTok and everyone was like, you need this product. And I was like, no, I don't. And then I got it and I was like, yes, I do. I love it. Like seriously. So I literally just put a dot. Oop, there's a dot. And then I dab. Don't do it. Don't do it. Mm, it's going to be so cringy. I did. Oh, okay. Sorry. <laughs> I just got secondhand embarrassment from myself. So I just got firsthand embarrassment. Okay. I want it to look like the sun came down and kissed me on my nose. I don't know how to contour my nose, but I put some right there and then I put some right here. This feels right to me. Someone could tell me it was wrong. I'd be like, no, 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 no. It's right. I take this Real Techniques brush, ASMR babes, heard of it? And then we blend it. We blend it so good. So now our nose is sun-kissed. <gasps> Someone's looking at me. I think the repairman is here. Oh no, the door dasher's here. Our door okay, anyways. Then I take it and I put it really high because TikTok told me so. And TikTok doesn't lie. I've been getting frisky and I put it on my forehead. Like that. 
Shandam. I hope somebody is doing their makeup with me because that's like really cute. Okay, so then I blend it. Cha 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 cha. I need to work on my blending skills. I get a little lazy, and then someone takes a photo of me, and I'm like, oh, okay. So uh, gotta work on that. Using the contour stick is honestly my favorite part of my whole makeup routine. That and blush. Cute. It's, it's cute, right? Say it's cute. Oh my. Oh. I just realized that I'm missing my blush brush, which I'm a little confused about, but the show must go on. I'm gonna go in with the Glossier Cloud Paint, and it is a liquid blush. I apply it with my finger and blend it with my finger, and then usually I'll go in with my brush to just really make sure it's all in there. Yeah. I put it right here. I thought that's where you're supposed to put a highlight, but then TikTok told me otherwise. I seriously love blush. Flores like down. Then I go in with the Milk Makeup Cream Blush. Okay, so I just warm it up on my finger. <laughs> it's right there. And I just streak it down my nose. Ooh, streak. Boom. And then I get some more. I just put it on the bulb of my nose. I know a lot of people try to make their nose look smaller, but I have a bigger nose and I actually really like it. I really like it. I take my highlighter and put it over my blush because I don't know where highlight is supposed to go. Blush goes right here now. So what, highlight is supposed to go like right here? I don't think so. I mean, maybe, but I don't know. I feel like the biggest difference for me is the mascara. Can I like a point the mascara on my tongue? I'm gonna curl my lashes. Does my eye look creepy? Okay. Sometimes I put this highlighter on my eyelid, like an eyeshadow. I'm not feeling it today, but I do do that sometimes. Do do. My favorite mascara is the telescopic mascara. Okay. My bestie for the rest of Daniela, put me on. Consider me on. Okay, <laughs> consider me on. The best stuff in the game. I always get on my eyelid. Ooh, okay, fun. Then the lip gloss. I love lip gloss. I wish I could sit in a bathtub of lip gloss. I don't actually wish that. That'd be sticky. Fenty Beauty Babes. Okay, honestly, this is pretty much out. I seriously love this stuff. Mwah. This is gonna be like the scene in the movies where the nerdy girl takes off her glasses and then the boy, whose name is probably Brad, is like, Oh my God, Rachel, you're beautiful. I'm having one of those moments. Oh my God, Rachel, you're beautiful. I think it looks better with the headband on. All right, so this is the makeup look. If you've watched this far and you're feeling generous, do me a big favor and go to my Instagram and like my two recent posts. If you DM me done, I'll follow you back. I pinky promise you I'll follow you back. Okay, thank you so much for watching. I hope you have a beautiful and blessed day. Bye guys, deuces. Mwah.